Hey Lisa. So as it's come to the end of the year, I thought it'd be nice to gather a few girls together to tell you how much we loved you. Lisa is a ball of energy that just throws out support, love, and encouragement everywhere she goes. You never feel left out when she's in the room. Always happy, bubbly. She's just nothing but sunshine. Love you. You're the heart and the soul of the studio, and I don't know what anyone would do without you. Merry Christmas, Lisa. I wish you a year of good health and happiness. Thank you for everything you've done and all you do at the studio. You are appreciated. Mwah. Thank you for making sure I am always breathing, and thank you for checking in on me every day when I had my concussion, even though I did that. Um. I thank you for checking in on me here in BC. Uh, I love you. Lisa, thank you so much for creating a studio and an amazing community where people can go and be themselves. You are a beautiful person inside and out. We love you. Thanks for never letting me hit the ground, both in pole and in life in general. Brass Beauties is my home away from home and my second family and has helped me to become a better version of myself. Lisa makes everyone that walks into her studio feel like a part of her family and a part of the Pole fam. And she is so filled with love and has such a genuine heart that you just can't help but love her. I'm gonna leave the studio for months at a time, even though I don't want to. Uh, I always come back feeling like I never left. Um, so thank you, Lisa, for being the most welcoming and kindest, most hardworking beauty there is. Hi, Lisa. Love you. Thank you for running the studio. Lisa. My pole, baby. What can I say? <laughs> I remember you walking into the studio on your first day for beginner's pole class and how in love you fell with Paul. And ever since then, it's just been a constant snowball of love and passion coming from you and into the studio. And let me just say, we cannot thank you enough. I completely adore you. I know that all of the other instructors adore you. All of our students adore you. Our community adores you. There's, there's no way that this studio would be what it is without you. Um, I just think that you're really an amazing woman. You've grown into such an incredible pole dancer. I'm, in, I'm so proud of you to see how far that you've come in all of these years and still coming to class and now teaching classes and running this place. It's incredible and I just, I love you so much. I'm super proud of you. Thank you for everything that you do for me and for all of us here. So Nikki threatened squats and I didn't want to forget to do this, but I'm at the studio, also known as my happy place, and what do I love about it? Um, it's helped me find me. I don't know. I, this place has made me so happy. <laughs> and I'm crying and I don't look happy, but it has. And I'm a completely different person than who I was when I started here. And it's not just the amount of clothes I wear. <laughs> it's just everything about Thank you. The studio, Brass Beauties, and all the amazing instructors um, has helped me out so much in the past two years. Um, I kind of lost myself for a while after I, I lost my dad, and I didn't really know how to get back to myself. And going into the studio for the first time, meeting Lisa and Nikki and all the other instructors and amazing students who have always been so supportive really brought me back to my strength um, emotionally and physically. So it's been an awesome journey and I would recommend it to anyone and especially Lisa. She's such a sweetheart. Thanks guys. Hi Lisa, Merry Christmas. I just want to say thank you for being you and thank you for making Brass Beauty feel like home as always. You know, I would not have those muscles and feel so sexy until I started those pole classes. So, thank you for making it a safe place for us. Hi Lisa, just wanted to say 
it's amazing how much that you do, how much passion you put into everything, and how much you care about all of us when we're in the studio and when we can't make it to the studio. We're so thankful for all of it. The most meaningful thing that you've ever done for me was the day that we were both early for the fashion show rehearsal and I was talking about my solo and the only thing that I could listen to at the time were breakup songs. And the one song that I wanted to do for my solo, I played for you and I couldn't even get through the whole song without crying. Um, so you turned the lights off, you turned up the music and left the studio and told me to just dance. And after the song was over, I didn't even feel like crying anymore. And I felt so much better. And you always know how to make me feel better. And you know what I need before I even know. And I think that just shows how caring and loving and amazing you are to everybody at the studio. And I think that's what makes Brass Beauty so special. I love you so much, and I hope you have the best Christmas ever. Hey, Lisa. Brass Beauty has allowed me to fight the aging process. It also allows me to leave my dorm life of living with three boys. I love all the girls that go there. Everybody is friendly. Everybody welcomes you. And I'm inspired every day by all the girls that manipulate their bodies into various shapes all while smiling, even though you know it hurts like holy hell. Breast Beauties is home. It's just home. Words can never express how grateful we are that you welcomed us both into your family. We love, we love you. you. Merry Christmas, Lisa. Natalie here. I just wanted to send you this very quick message to thank you for being such an amazing and incredible woman and for building this studio, which is a safe space for so many people and that welcomes everyone with open arms. It wouldn't be the way it is if you weren't the way you are. So thank you. And I thought I'd let you know that there's a couple things that I believe that the studio has really reinforced to me over the last couple years. One, it is a place that has taught me that women can and are helping each other to lift up rather than tear each other down. There's a lot of support at the studio. Two, it has taught me that kindness matters to people, whether you're going through emotional, physical, financial, or personal struggles of any kind, there's always an open ear at the studio. And I think it is a place of such support because it truly is an extension of who you are as a person. And lastly, the studio has taught me that you have to be authentic and do you no matter what anybody else thinks. And it's all about letting go of all of those preconceived notions that we have about ourselves as people and what people think of us and what we're supposed to do. And it really lets you throw it all to the wind and live your life and have an expression that is both physical and artistic. So you should be very, very proud of building such a place, Lisa. And I hope that you have a very Merry Christmas and only the best for you and the studio in the new year. See you soon. Merry Christmas, Lisa. Brass Beauties is a place where no matter what's going on in your life, you can just come and recharge. Um, you can be in the worst mood ever when you walk through that door, but before you leave, you are refreshed and full of energy and just ready to take on whatever it is that's uh, bothering you or bringing you down in life. Uh, I'm so grateful to have all these women in our lives and I'm so grateful to have Lisa. There's so many times when I was just ready to give up on myself and she wouldn't let me. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you. Um, Merry Christmas.